I feel like without this game, I probably wouldn't have like even got into Call of Duty, into like many shooters. I mean, I was a shooter guy, obviously, but without this game, honestly, it's just, I don't know, bro. I don't know, so I don't know why I'm rushing down mid with an Uzi. I was about to say, I heard this guy in here. That's another really good thing about the Uzi. It's got, like, the best hit fire in this game. Oh. Okay. I actually completed the, uh, Uzi Obsidian Challenge on the night that, uh, Vanguard came out. That was, like, basically the last time I even touched this game. And then they just come back, play Warzone, make a video or two, you know what I'm saying? Also, that's another... Hold on. Also, that's another bad thing about this game is that as soon as uh, one team gains the advantage and like wins two rounds, three rounds, it just... everybody else starts leaving. Uh, you can never really find a full lobby that stays the entire game on. That's really sad. Hey, no, you can't because this game has one of the best movement systems, one of the best, like... Like, it's just period, one of the best Call of Duty games to just play and relax to. Well, I guess not relax to, because, you know, there's certain situations that are stressful. But it's just a really good, just all around amazing Call of Duty game. Except I could never find out how mantling actually works in this game. Of me, dude. That's also really like there's there's so many flaws in this game that it kind of makes it hard to play as you're starting to play it. That was a really nice shot. Like in that instance, I couldn't shoot through that guy. You can't shoot through your teammates, which I know is, it's realism in that, but like it's also a game. You know, you can't really take yourself as seriously. It's not like we're playing a. I don't know, Tarkov or Rainbow Six or something. This is still Call of Duty, like it's... I mean, like, Call of Duty's always taking itself seriously, but... I still don't get why you can't shoot through your teammates, that's all. <laughs> Am I in the middle of a highlight reel? Hovik is just one of those maps where it's like, you can just be on either side and still have a really good chance of winning, honestly. I feel like Hovik might be one of the best, just balanced maps in this game. But it's kind of crazy we got it twice in a row now. The only place you really need to worry about is down mid. Oh, Wolf's just gonna camp, okay. My boy Ethan. Search and destroy. <laughs> well, at least he didn't call me Ethereum, Jesus. 
You wouldn't believe how many people have actually called me Ethereum in game because they can't like figure out that the K is just supposed to be an A. Where are you going? Yikes. Yeah, I'm dead. I really didn't know what to do there. My team is still camping, even though like... Yeah, top, bro. But they're also camping, so it's like, come on, bro. They got me I need emotional support. He's gonna. Uh oh. Calm down, please. No! <laughs> Why are you running stuns in search and destroy, man? That's so stupid. Well, at least he didn't just 725 me. I, I respect the uh, finisher. I'm just really mad that Battle Harden doesn't really work in this game because if it if it worked like Tac Mask does in like Cold War, I would definitely run it in this game. But it doesn't really do anything to negate the uh, effects, which just honestly sucks. Please don't. Bro, you gotta stop. They should have removed this gun so, like, at least two years ago. I wonder how many times I've died to a 725. Probably at least over 10,000 at least. Probably not 10,000, probably five. You're gonna drop shot, stand up, and then immediately drop shot again? Bomb is ours. Destroy their weapon Just gonna have to hard push. Salty. A max, okay. Behind, behind, behind. How'd that nice. miss? I don't know. I really don't know. I don't know how it missed either. You probably should could have killed me, honestly, but. Oh, you shot like right next to my head, I see. That was a pretty good lineup though. I don't know why you guys were just all sitting up. Maybe they were having like a slumber party or something up there, I don't know. And here he comes. Nice, bro. <laughs> Best gun in the game. 725 guy rushes down mid, so if I can just get behind them on mid, I should be fine. Maybe I can just sit right here. Nice. But my team is too scared to push up. We're just all gonna sit back in our little corner. Look at this guy. Are you fertilizing bees or something? Gotta admire the grass real quick. You're not even aiming. You're aiming at like their pinky toes right now if they were to come around the corner. This guy, you gotta stop. You gotta stop. Stop drop shotting, please. Amazing. 
first time I've seen him not drop shot and he actually won. As long as there aren't too many snipers. Weren't you there last time I used this route? Everybody, be hot. Oh, man. Nice. I kind of predicted he would be mid. Are they gonna call me a cheater again? You were just in a really predictable spot. Calm down. I, that's not how you pop dead silence. Oh, Discord noty. Oh, please, man. Let me... Uh, all right. I just want to, like, pick up the gun and not have to recock it every single time. I really don't get that, but it's whatever. We won anyway. Oh, hold on. I'm just, there we go. Drop shot king over here. No. Nope. Okay. And 725. Just get the f <laughs> the f already gone. Can't even see my replay. Oh, you can. The MA fight actually stupid. Hey, GG's. <laughs> Nobody wants to hear you breathe. Boy, shut the oh. See? Well, Talking over a video game, you know how hard. Keep using that 725. Shut up. Goofy. Whoa, okay. And ladies and gentlemen, that is Call of Duty. <laughs> Just straight to the N word, huh? Wow, okay. Straight negativity on Modern Warfare today, I guess. Anyway. <laughs>